particular. Yeah. NASA ships stuck at the top of Niagara Falls for more than 100 years actually shifts. Yeah, the flat-bottomed iron scow has been grounded since 1918 when it broke loose from a tugboat. Park officials say heavy rains and fierce winds now on, hallowed, on Halloween night, actually, flipped the iron vessel onto its side and spun it downriver about 150 feet. Now that's weird to hit that on Halloween night. That is scary. That's the spooky song. Okay, for sure. Well, the point is, the fix is next. Here's Dick. Oh, that's coming up. Like that <laughs> angle. Maybe <laughs> there's something supernatural going on there because they've had heavy rains a few times over sure. the last hundred years. Yeah. <laughs> We're working on stories coming up from East Point, Macomb Township, and from Utica. Also, another local community forced to take action after water tests come back showing lead levels above what the state says is okay. But first, the YouTube video that has DPD investigating one of their own. You'll hear from the man who shot the video, showing what he says is a police officer taking a nap on the job at 6. Yes! <laughs> but you know what's so funny is that usually when they say that, that's the main, like, when it comes yeah. out, it's usually about, you know, tragedy, five killed downtown. That's what shit, but it's odd seeing the police officer sleeping that's on the job. Awesome. Where the red mark is where it oh. starts. Go like that. Oh, it's, it's, it starts now. It's now. A dog is seen carried by its head, and a video police say proves a case of animal cruelty in Macomb County. Was a Detroit police officer sleeping on the job? The man who shot this video says that's exactly what you're seeing. The video appeared on YouTube yesterday. And now Detroit police are investigating what the uploader says he captured on camera. The video shows several police vehicles at the port of Detroit, but as Larry Spruill explains, the focus is on one in particular. He's still asleep. Look. This video is catching the attention of a lot of people across Metro Detroit Monday. Head back, he gone, look. Including Detroit police. <laughs> That's because the video now posted on YouTube shows one of its officers allegedly sleeping on the job. As I walked into the tunnel, I noticed the officer uh, head back in his car. Ozzy Johnson is the man behind the camera. He says he was walking near the Windsor Tunnel when he saw the officer inside the car. I didn't know if there was something wrong with him or if he was possibly sleeping on the job which as taxpayers I will have a problem with. On my way out, he woke up. And I told him, I said, man, we need you out here in the city. <laughs> and I was even standing there next to the car on my way out, yelling, hey, wake up, wake up. And it wasn't until another officer pulled up and said, hey, he's videotaping you. Johnson claims that's when the officer demanded he delete the video and pictures out of his phone. What's up? Or what? Just stay up, man. We paying you to stay up. We need you out here, man. <laughs> and I also did reach out to a spokesperson for Detroit Police, and they tell me they are aware of the video. They are looking at the video, and they are investigating the claims of this case as well. We are live at police headquarters tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4. <laughs> We've got some breaking news just in. Federal agent Mitchell.